Mathematically, we've shown that the classical Gram-Schmidt method computes the exact same values as does the modified Gram-Schmidt method. But we know that computers don't compute exactly. We store real numbers as floating point numbers, and in doing so, we incur some Randolph error. Also, when we compute with these floating point numbers, we may incur some more Randolph error. So a question is, do these methods actually compute mutually orthonormal columns? from a given matrix A. In the next homework, you're going to investigate this. And then in the next video, we will discuss what it is that you observed.